I'm Mel Gibson. This is a quick tutorial on how I record metal bass guitar. The bass guitar is what glues everything together in a mix. The most important piece of gear and the key to a great sound, is the bass guitar itself. Getting a solid bass guitar is a good investment so go get one now. There. Plug in your newly acquired bass guitar into your audio interface. Either line input or instrument input. Set the in gain to a reasonable level. With a good bass guitar you should be able to get a good bass guitar sound right away. Use the knobs and equalizers on the bass guitar itself to optimize the sound. Record the bass. What I usually do when I mix bass guitar is that I have two tracks with different settings and post-processing. One clean bass track and one dirty distorted bass track. These are blended in the mix. We'll get to that later. First add a compressor with a high ratio that compresses the shit out of your track. Set a fast attack and longer response time. This will even out volume changes but most importantly, prevent lower frequencies from jumping all over the place. Add an equalizer and cut around 500 Hz. Put a bit of Lopus filter on their swell to tame the highs. Now copy the recorded bass and put it on a new track. This is going to be the distorted channel. Add your favorite distortion to this track. It could be a app simulator like Revolver or Guitarig. There is often a built-in distortion or amp modeler in every recording software. Set the distortion so it sounds like shit. Then use a high pass and a low pass filter to remove the lower and higher frequencies, creating a mid-heavy distorted sound. Blend the two tracks. Listen to the end results and headbang the shit out of your parents. This shit is tight. Fucking awesome. <laughs>